Okay. Let's see. How does it go up? Okay, it's going up, so. Or sort of. Ah. No. We'll see. Okay. Okay. So. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Alright. I'm going to continue now with Pokemon Violet. Um, hmm. In theory, at least. Come on. <sighs> I'm just kind of holding still a second and seeing if... Uh, okay, there it goes. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Alrighty. Hello, hello! Let's so continue onward. And I could continue to just look at food. While I wait to see if anybody pops in this fine evening. So this thing seems to be working well. I was a little bit worried that it wouldn't because, um, the weather. Alright. Oh, I got a Pokeball. For free! Woo. Um. I'm just, like I said, I'm just gonna wait here a second. So, what is this? Oh, how cute. Could I be in? Yeah. Can I find out what's up if I talk to you? I was curious before. Thought maybe. Because I found out that it doesn't always show. Yeah. <laughs> There's some things with the game, but you know, I, I don't. That's pretty funny. Um. <laughs> Uh, running around while well, I just wait to see the cafe. Hmm. Actually, I should look at what I'm using party-wise, right? All right. So check summary. Uh, grass, normal, electric, fairy, psychic fairy, normal fairy. Okay. Um, I guess. <sighs> so this will, mm, I mean, it would help grass. Ish. I mean, hmm. I don't think I'd want anything from there. Just based on what I'm seeing. I feel like I should go be able to go into more buildings, you know? Like, seriously. So I was just, you know. I didn't really look, I just was looking at the deliciousness of the food before. Um, so we got a marmalade sandwich, fighting, I don't have any fighting, don't have any on my team, don't have any on my team. Okay. I get the feeling I'm not going to find what I want <laughs> for my team made of fairies and, um, like, when you look at the summary, it's like, yeah, I got a normal, uh, that's, that's, uh, chonkers, but other than that, uh, I mean, a lot of them are fairy. Kind of interesting. That, that was, I mean, unintentionally how I went with things. Welcome to Shurikans! Um, I'd like to look at what you, you sell. I don't know what would do what. Probably with his ability to make it visually striking. Yeah. I don't know. Like, I feel like... I'm not going to find anything for psychics here. So I think I'm probably going to just go to the school in a second. I want to go in here. 
Like, this is a building I feel like I should be able to go into. Kind of thing, because it's, it's got all of the things that you would expect for a store like that. Like, see, this one is similar. Well, it's not a bookstore. It's like you can look at, um, these are certainly unique looking. Um, I just don't know if I'd want anything. Hello, Charisma. How are you? Nope, I don't want to buy anything. And then, like, this store. Again, it totally looks like it's a store I should be able to go into, you know? I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you, you will feel better soon. Or that you are feeling better. I'm not sure what, if you are or not. Um... I want to catch that. But I can't. Let's see again. It's like... Shopping online? Uh, is this another Seabreeze Cafe? Hello, Faizoa! How are you? Or, hello, Zoa. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. How are you? I hope you've been well. Yeah. Alright, so that's the C, so this is... N Where is it? Why? And hello, Mr. Failure! How are you as well? What's going on in these stores? Anyway, I'm about to go to the school. I was just looking around a little, again, just to see what can I go into. Ah. No. They be napping in other rooms. I'm glad to hear that you're doing the same as usual. Because I assume that failing at this point, I just... And I'm glad to hear you're all right, Zoa. Um, anyway, um, me, I'm decent and I had to deal with family today. Or not, like, immediate family, but, like, grandparents and stuff. And it was nice seeing them. It was just very stressful. Yeah. I have family. I have extended family. All right. Um, I'm having my usual of coffee, a little bit of hot chocolate, a little bit of collagen, and a little bit of vodka. Well, it's not really my usual. <clears throat> yeah. That's the question now, isn't it? Um, I survived well. I mean, the thing is, I, the closest rel extended family member that I have is, huh, I said I had vodka in it, didn't I? I was just saying that normally I don't do, I, I don't always do, so that's what I was saying is not the usual. That's all. I do have. Alright, so, it's quite nice. What is this that I'm looking at? Oh, is this a clothing store? I guess. Yeah, I guess it is. Or I think it's a hair salon. Is it? Hi. What uh, can we do for you today? I just want to look. Uh, I'm good. 3,000 is a bit much. Besides, I'm a rebel who still follows the rules. That's why I have technically dyed hair. <laughs> but I still wear my uniform. Alright, I'm going up to the school now. Anyway, um, but yeah, no, I got a little bit of vodka. And again, I noted this last time, or on Saturday, but this school is heavily, re reminds me heavily of, um, the one from Soul Eater. Don't you get it? If you join Team Star, you can shine as brightly as anybody. Good to know. Question mark. Seriously, what's with you? Don't you want to burn with, with awesome friends like us? You feel old? It's not that old. Not really. I mean, I, I guess it technically is, but in the sense of just... Look, we got a quota to, supposed to fill for new members, so just sign up already. Um, I'd rather not. <sighs> I'll help her out. I feel bad. I mean, to be fair, like, if you, uh, solely to... And then you got Fire Force, and you got some other. 
I went and picked the anime of Soul Eater. I liked the beginning of it, but then, and while I do think the ending's a decent ending, I still find the ending for the anime to be distasteful in that y you got the series continued forward. Like I said, with the fact that the series was still extremely ongoing and we hadn't gotten to the point that they were doing things more like uh, My Hero Academia where it was like, either you go into, um, at that point, if you looked at it, it was either a alternate ending or it was um, filler. It was just never ending filler. So to that extent, I say it was a reasonable ending that fit within what you could expect perhaps from what you had gotten so far. I'm sure that my hero has filler at this point. I'm, I'm saying that you're far less likely to have a series where it goes into super filler for years on end nowadays. That was all I was saying. Yeah, that's fair. I'm not saying they aren't. I mean, the fact of the matter is, they basically started doing that. That wasn't my point. My point is that it was around the time, and that was one of the first series you really started seeing, where instead of going into filler, they just stopped the series until the next several chapters were done. The thing is, they have been doing way too many for that to really work anymore. I, so I'm not disagreeing that they, they've got to have filler at this point. I was just saying, using it as an example of, like, that point in time where things started changing. But, you know. Huh? You want in on this too? Why are they grunts? If you're here to sign up, we'll get you next. We've nearly got this one in the back. We're Team Star Kid. We burn too bright to even look at directly. But you knew that, right? No. Anyway, uh, another ignorant little nobody. Here I'm finally part of Star Team Star. Still, I get no respect. I gotta work my way up the ranks. Hey, can't we just let something like this slide? The honor of the team's on the line. So we've got no real choice but the battle, yeah? That's true. So you keep watch over the four little four eyes over there. I'll make sure this fresh face nobody ends up seeing stars. Um, really? That's so dumb. You're challenged by Team Star Grunt. Anyway, um, well, I'm not disagreeing, now am I? All right, um, all right, what was that against? Um, I guess let's do fight. Yeah, but, yeah, use Leer, grand battle, fight. dead. I'm not disagreeing on that. I was just like literally using it as a, a, a just an example of the time. Yeah, that's what you get. How come I'm the one seeing stars? Again, I wasn't discussing Menace or anything like that. I was literally discussing it as a um, example of when you started seeing series where they weren't going into filler never ending filler I mean that was what I meant and the thing is all I was saying is I respect that it's later didn't go into the whole filler forever although I didn't like the ending I just felt that it was reasonable for the um, type of ending it was but then at the same time I'm kind of left with but like they could have ended it in a slightly um, like, if you were to <laughs> read the manga, it's so different at that point. It's like, so I, I, I love, um, I, I love the manga for Soul Eater. Ugh. Why isn't nobody like you so good at battling anyway? That's just not right. No way, she beat you? Does that mean I gotta battle this kid now since I'm higher up the ranks? Pero bueno. What do you think you're doing? Hello, Nimona. That's that student council dweeb. She's gonna report us if we don't book it. I can't believe you, Arthur. You don't have to go finding randos to battle. You'll have all the battles you'll need with me. Again, I'm left with this girl is super suspicious, if you know what I mean. 
Uh, that's not really what happened. What? They picked a fight with you? Wow, I read this way wrong. Sorry. Anyway, point being... <laughs> it... it at the very least, it was, it ended it before, it, it, this whole other thing, it, it, I was just left with at least they ended it before they went too far off. Like other series. Did. Um. I get it now. You two have got star, Team Star written all over you for sure. I bet you were trying to pressure people into signing up again, weren't you? Uh, hi. We were not not doing that. Well, that explains it. As head of the student council, stopping this type of nonsense would normally be my job. But this is also the perfect chance for you to try my amazing and ultra rare gift to you. You obtained a Terra Orb. I don't know if I wanted that. You put it in your key items pocket. Alright. Anyway, um, but like I said, it, I like them up later. With this Terra Orb, you can terrestrialize your Pokemon during battle. Let's see, after it terrestrializes, I'm pretty sure your Sprigigato will be a grass type. Duh! Normally you've got to take special classes to be able to get one of these, but I put in a good word for you. Now time to give it a whirl. You'll learn how to use it faster in battle than if I just explain it to you. Wait, what? You want this kid to practice welling on us with her Terra Pokemon? Is that it? Got a problem? You want to mess with me, battle me instead? She have winked there, if it's got the little winky noise? Ugh, never mind. I'll take my chance with the new kid, or at least look like she was trying to wink. Then, take your places and battle! Some of the animations and I, I mean, I know it's a Game Freak game, and I'm just like, yeah, that's it. But still... Like, at least you could have had her wink. When you make the, the sound that makes it clear she's winking. You are challenged by the Team Star Grunt. He sends out Young Goose. Go, Suna! Alright, can crystallize the crystallize button in battle. Uh huh. Got it. You won't be able to heal up at the Pokemon Center. Got it! Can I. Alright, so terrestrialize, I guess. Yeah. Okay, I guess use this? I'm confused. Okay. Got it. I suck it! Lovely. <laughs> Squeak. Uh, yep, that's exactly. Oh wow, so I better go heal. The opposing Yungus fainted. But hey, Butterball leveled up! Butterball wants to learn the move Bite. Or, that was Butterball, right? Um, let's look at what we've got. I like Lick and I like Covet. Um, new move. Let's see. Because it's got the paralysis, and then you've got the growl, and then you've got tackle. Between tackle and bite, I think that I would pick bite. I'm going to ask what Butterball wants to do. <laughs> yeah. It's like, duh. There's one answer. One, two, and ta-da. And learn to bite instead. I defeated the grunt. Yeah, take that. Your Pokemon burns so bright. I got extra money. Pfft. Why is she cheering? When her team was? Yeah. You know what? I'm not going to question anything. Um, anyway. Going back to what I was originally saying with the Soul Eater thing. It just, the school reminds me heavily of the Soul Eater school. Nice. You pulled off terrestrializing, no problem. Moves of your Pokemon Terra type will even hit even harder when it's terrestrialized, you know. Sometimes you'll find a Pokemon whose Terra type is totally different from its usual type. That difference can open up your strategic options. Gotta charge your Terra Orb at the Pokemon Center after every use by healing your team, though. Do I? 
Well, well, I'll be on my merry way, then yeah, yeah, ha, hasta la vista, me, me too, hasta la vista, or, like, so yeah, Team Star is basically the group of students that like to kick up trouble, they hardly ever show up to class, and when they get together in groups, they're a real headache, even the teachers don't know what to do with them, as far from what I hear, uh, excuse me, I, uh, I just, well, thanks, So yeah, see you around. Uh, I feel like I know that individual in a way. Ah, oh, look at you! Already becoming a big hero around campus. I don't think I've seen that girl around. Maybe she's a new transfer like you. That Evie bag, though. I love the fluff. Yeah, like I said, I know somebody else who would definitively wear that kind of stuff and stuff. Anyway, seems like the trouble's died down, so we better book it up to school. Well, not die of hair, but get ready to climb the worst staircase in the world. So what's my favorite manga? Uh, book, comic, manga. Okay, I don't know about comic. It's been years. Um, I know my favorite manga. Uh, you probably both enjoy and find weird, and probably not enjoy. Um, Katekyo Hitomen uh, Reborn. Or actually, it's Katekyoshi, I believe. It's Katekyo. Hitman Reborn. But basically, um, Home Tutor Reborn, effectively. And yes, that's exactly how it's... Interesting. Um, I, the, the title in English was effectively, it was called Reborn because they basically just removed the Katekyoki. Katekyo, bleh. That was it. Everything else was... Oh my goodness, I need that cuteness. I'll have to find one. But, um, basically, the series... I mean, it's dumb, but it's definitely one of my favorites. And honestly, again, I, I would say manga over anime anytime. Like, completely and totally. Um... For example, I mean, although, to be fair, in both ways, yeah, you're not getting it out of, like, reading, because it's, it's not in, uh, unless you know Japanese, I guess, but good for you, but as I was saying, um, <laughs> the series was never fully, um, even the, the manga, as far as I could ever find, I did look for ages, but then, and I might be wrong, so I'm not going to say that I'm completely right, but I had, I, I wanted to buy all the volumes of manga because I really liked it. And a friend got me to start reading it, and then um, so basically, then um, I really got into it. Got pa I, I read past what they were and all that. Uh, but point being, I wanted to buy the volumes of manga because I, I still wanted to at least have, like, I guess you could say a legit copy. Um, but then at that time I found that I could not find, um, beyond a certain point, even if I was willing to spend hundreds of dollars. And then I found out that it seems that Viz Media never fully translated it to English. Can I go in? Yes, I can. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's the fact that it's, um, the whole idea is basically you've got this average... I'm going to be honest, I did that first. I just wanted a, well, one, I wanted a book copy because I like being able to carry it with me. And at that time, I did not have any other way. Unless I was willing to go on the computer. <laughs> it's been forever waiting. But um, basically, I, I found that it was the, A, the anime was never dubbed to English. And in fact, it was impossible to get in English. B, the manga, I think it was like, I don't remember what volume it was, but it was only about halfway through the series, I think, where they stopped um, releasing it in the U.S., or translating it and releasing it. So, <laughs> I mean, with that one, if I want to read it, yeah, I, I actually have to go into the gray area because it, it wasn't 
um, release. I, I really did want to buy the copies, though. I was like, for no other reason than to fill my bookshelves. If you really want to go there. I, I like filling my bookshelves with books. It's enjoyable, because then I don't have to go and f remember names, and that I just have it right there. Especially for favorite series. And for some series that you would never find online anyway. But, point being, um... <sighs> For that one, I really was into the series. I really got into it. Um, definitely one of my favorites. The main, what I was gonna say is the main character one day finds out that he's a future mafia boss. And his reaction is no. <laughs> but basically, the a top it, Hitman is sent to train him and da 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 and you know you've got you've actually got lots of guns and stuff in that one if you're interested but um I wouldn't recommend the anime version because they make it look more goofy but the, the manga they, they really do not make it as goofy because you know they aren't thinking oh kids are gonna watch it definitely a lot darker too with lots more theme dark themes and stuff as well interestingly enough point being I quite like that one and I would say, even to this day, it is one of my actual all-time favorites. And I like the anime too. I just don't like it as much. I, I felt it was very... Especially when I went back to reread the manga after being kind of disappointed. I was like, obviously it really was nostalgia maybe that made me tap with it. And then I read the manga I was like, no. No, it's just the anime is... Um, how do I put this? Kind of crappy comparison. There's just so much that it's just thrown away from the series and the anime. They're just kind of that's why I say I don't like mind as much with the uh, Soul Eater because I, in a lot of ways it doesn't feel as um, almost offensive to me as the, the Kotaku Hit and Reborn in a lot of ways because at least it started out pretty close and then it was just like with the the anime for it was it, by chapter three. The entire vibe for the series is it's just kind of... Yeah, that's probably true with the, the anime to manga versus MCU and comics. Um, I'm not going to deny it. Point being, I'm... It, it was just one of those things where, especially going back and re-watching, I was just left with... I just... On an official source, I, I did watch official source... For the anime, technically, I think. I'm not entirely sure, but in theory. Um, and I just realized, no, it wasn't that the... It's just the anime doesn't have the same charm. And super dark tones to it. You know, you had whole things. Like, you have a character who... Um, let's just say they try to quote-unquote learn to fly. If you will. Um, but I liked the character. I, I, it was really well characterization and stuff. I really got into it. Um, in fact, I, I love pretty much every series that author's ever written. But, um, yeah. It, it just disappointed me when I realized I could not buy the manga. So I really did want to. Like, I can get the Japanese, but I wanted to be able to hold it in my hands and read it, you know? Anyway, back to the game for a second. Here we are. Welcome to Uva Academy. This here is the entrance hall. You can sign up for all kinds of classes at the desk behind me, and those halls off to the sides lead to a di whole different parts of the school. It's totally big enough to let loose and battle in here, but for some reason they ban Pokemon battling in the main entrance. No, duh. Miss Hartaku, Miss Nimona, how did you find your first school commute? Um, I can't say what I'd really want to say, which is it was kind of meh. I'm gonna go with we had a blast because it wasn't really tough at all. I imagine Miss Nomoto's high spirits helped with that. Not really. She true asked it to our friend Academy. Mostly she kind of creeps me out. I'm, I hate to say that. Clavel. Not that I was expecting any less from our champion rank student council president. Reliable as ever, Miss Nomoto. Well, I know how to look after my friends, right? But speaking of which, we saw some of those Team Starcraft kids in town, Director. You did? Where? It was down the stairs for the front gate. They were hassling a kid with an Eevee backpack. This is quite the news. They still have to be found. Out there? 
actually, um, I had to fuck on them and they ran off. You don't say. I don't know if I really did that. Of course, it's a fine thing to try and help a fellow student. But you may wish to show a bit of restraint as you find your feet here at our academy. I wasn't really showing restraint. Or that, it wasn't that I wasn't showing restraint. It was just, you know. Anyway, point being. Um, yeah. And Miss Nimona, do you remember that the school staff here has here to resolve any such issues. Oh, sure, right. Of course, Director. Yeah, totally. A child with an Eevee backpack, you say. I suppose that might have been Miss Penny. I am relieved to hear she's come to class, at least. Oh, she... <laughs> ah, and Miss Nimona, if you would be so good, go do report to Mr. Jacques about his Team Star business. As your home room teacher, he should be kept appraised of all such goings on. You got it, sir. Ah, but look at the time. You two had better hurry along to classes. We'll be starting soon. Okay. We're in class 1A, Otaku. Come on, I'll show you the way. Of course we are. Um, I should have known. I'm proud of the... F huh. Good morning, Mr. Jacques. Meh. Hello, hello, everyone. It's kind of sad that Harvest Stella, a farming and an RPG game, runs so much better. Yeah. Sure. I think I have the equivalent of that. I have Pokemon. But everyone else does too. Which, to be fair, I think that it makes everyone probably a lot safer in a lot of ways. After all, if somebody tries to cause a problem, clearly Simply snap, it's dealt with. In a way, if you think about it. But, um, I'm not saying that it's... Uh, point being, yeah. If you're really gonna go there, you know? Anyway, we have some exciting news this morning. Who wants to hear it? Not I. Ooh, me! I want to hear this go... Oh, look at how bad... Uh, I think they need to patch this game. I suppose I should have told you a little sooner. But we have a new little friend joining our happy homeroom as of today. Do we? Oh, is it me? Yeah, that's right. I wonder what they'll be like. <laughs> well, I mean... I don't know. Possibly. Of course, at the same time... <laughs> somebody could probably just deal with it. With this. Hello, Kevin. How are you? <sighs> Um, not really. You didn't miss a whole lot. I just kind of ran around. We were discussing anime, because I mentioned, again, I, I feel like this school reminds me of Soul Eater. I was asked which one was my favorite anime, or an manga slash anime, and I was just like, could that get me more? Hey, <laughs> that would be just, that would be terrifying, Mr. Billy. I don't think I would have missed you, no. All right, you can come in. Yeah, me. Somewhat rebellious, but not really. Also, not the weirdest person here, I don't think. And again, I'm kind of left with, I feel like... It's like, could you trouble you to... With a few words introducing yourself. Um, right. <laughs> so common collective. She's pretty cool. No, what? Well, no, yeah, that's true in a lot of ways. It's like, destroy the world. Corrupt everything, yeah. Missing no is terrifying. Looks like everyone's eager to get to know you. All right, then. Who wants to be the first to ask our friend a question? Me, me. Can I ask a question? What's your favorite thing about Pokemon? Um. Huh. Um. Can I say I don't know? Apparently not. I feel like I should be able to say I don't know because, I mean, I like the, I, I, I'll just go with I like everything because it's just kind of like, eh. Really? Awesome. I totally feel, I'm totally the same. Dude. Does anyone else have a question for their new classmate? Me! I have a question, Miss Suspicious. <laughs> you went to all the trouble of enrolling here, so spill. What do you hope to get out of it? You must have some kind of dream, right? I don't know. I have never played a Pokemon game before. At least not a mainline one. I think I played... I, I might have played a Poke Park game. <laughs> like, let's be fair here. Fair. I get it. The possibilities are endless, right? Who can decide? And I'm not kidding on that one. <laughs> well, thank you for telling us a bit about yourself, Otaku. 
I'm Mr. Jacques. I teach biology here at the academy. I'm also your homeroom teacher. That's your seat. Second front row from the front. Oh, thank goodness. I don't think I could stand being able, having to sit next to Nimona. I hate to say it. I, she seems nice, but it, I, would, I think I'd feel very awkward in just a normal setting. <laughs> I am glad to hear that you're doing a lot better. And, um, yeah, I, 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 I wish I could help, but I really can't. Other than, I could distract you. Oh, sorry. All right, you ragamuffins. Be nice and friendly to our new classmate. Mm-hmm. Ragamuffins. Kiddos. Be well, Mr. Jacques. The anime. I am... I get to know the academy by exploring a bit. Like, wait, do I need to go to school? Okay, biology, math is available to take. Can I take my math, my biology? Look, it's the academy. Okay, what? I'm not looking for Nimona. Huh? She got called in the staff room just now. I just don't know what. Also, yeah, I can move around the school. Okay, I choose a location and start exploring. I'm going to the cafeteria because food. Let's be real. I like food. Ah, uh, I see. So now I go to speak to him, right? Even though I want to look at the food. Oh, hey, so we meet again. You remember me, right? Yeah. From the lighthouse. You know, if I have a friend to you, you don't seem very. You seem to be <laughs> annoying to Nimona. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> uh, probably not. Yeah, exactly. That's my little know-it-all buddy. Got a mind to keep, like a steel trap, eh? Sure. Don't need to tell me your name. Or talk to you, right? Yeah, I know. Nimona's really loud. <laughs> I like food more. Whole school seems to be talking about you. The new kid who showed up at the president of the student council. I mean, it's, I think that's how pretty much most many people feel. <laughs> I mean, especially after a while, I mean, uh, I normally wouldn't even bother showing up for class, but I came all the way to school today. Remember, I mentioned before, I, maybe you don't know, I'm um, an Aspie. School, while I love learning things and stuff, it was no bueno. <sighs> class, but I came to tell you today just to talk to you, our new celebrity. Wow. You gotta help me out so I can finally make my dream a reality. What's this dream first? <laughs> it caught in your interest, have I? You wanna hear about my dream, right? Um. Well, this might catch you with a surprise, but fact is, I'm all about the picnic. You know what, my man? You are my best friend. You just don't know it yet. The great outdoors. Perfectly prepared sandwiches, all of it. Yes, my best friend. I declare we are best friends, Arvin. Not half bad at cooking either, I can tell you. Um, quite, I guess you could say that. I mean, like, with my my friends, I would not be too quiet. Although, I, I sometimes got really surprised because, like, for one of my friends, I was like, she's very talkative. But then I found out, like, the teachers were like, oh, she's so quiet. And I'm like, yeah, yes, I have friends. Anyway, right now, I'm researching new recipes that will help Pokemon feel better. Real health food, you see. Mmm, I get that. I found this book the other day, and it had a section on Herba Mystica things. Well, you know, you get used to it. <laughs> so basically, there's some kind of special herbs that heal up the mining Pokemon as soon as they eat them. There are a total of five different types of Herba Mystica, based on what I read. Just taking a little lick of them, and they've been powdered. will get your blood flowing, provided the nutrients prevent aging. It'll even boost... The immune system. Well, so long as you have the right ingredients for your fried chicken, your fried chicken can still be pretty healthy. These herbs seem like they're the real deal. Only found here in Paldea. I've read a boot. Seriously. But this game says they're all guarded by Titan Pokemon, meaning it's going to be pretty tough to try and grab a few sprigs. See, Titans are... Well, I think they've got to be things like this. I see... Okay... Good to know. Anyway, point being, I mean, there's things that can be pretty good and that can both taste good and 
be good for you in a lot of ways. I really want to get those herbs for myself, but I'm not very good at Pokemon battles. Don't have any friends with strong Pokemon to lend me a hand either. I'll be your friend! We both like food! And I'd never hear the end of it if I went crawling to that soon because And you don't like Nimona! I mean, I think Nimona's okay and all, but, like, you don't get along. She might act a little less odd if I have other friends, especially friends she doesn't like. So, maybe? <laughs> and besides, more importantly, food. But here you waltz up. You've got to help me out with this. You're perfect. Yes. <laughs> you know, that's a good question. Why don't we fight the people? Nope, wait. I don't need an answer yet. I just want to... I'll just register the places that seem to be... Might be titans on your map for you. Cool. We can hang out. As well. I love your case. It's very... Floral. Fair enough. The titan's layers have been added to your map. Also... <laughs> yeah, that's a good question. And heck, what if you had the Pokemon just attack the person themselves? Hmm? Let it stew a bit. We can get more into the details later. In the meantime, take this. A little gift for listening and all. Oh, thank you. A bag of Stardust. You put it in your treasure pocket. What is it? It can be sold at a low price. That's the shops. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I don't know about that one. Can I look at the food? What can I do? Oh, they're bee Pokemon. Oh, I, I wanted to... See, that's the thing. I didn't... I, I suspected as much. I have to... I can't... Like, it's... Uh, like, you can see where there's food. Right? It's just like, nope, you can't eat. It's kind of sad. <laughs> Rasta ta ta ta. Yeah. That is unfortunate. You know what? I'll go there. That is true. This is our taku, correct? I hacked your smartphone so I could talk to you. I hope you don't mind. Yeah, I know. It's like no food. Um, is this Penny? I'm sorry. Who are you? Oh no, Cassiopeia. Interesting. My name's Cassiopeia, but never mind that. It's you I want to talk about. I hear a trainer with a serious potential. It's that description. It's accurate. There's something I'd like to ask of you. Tell me, Artaku. You know about Team Star, right? I should have said no, but yes. Great. I appreciate you being up front here. Team Star is a group of troublemakers formed by the Academy students a while back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That is true. They caused headaches for the school and tried to bring other students down to their level. Probably didn't actually hack. Probably got the like number from Nimona because Nimona doesn't seem the type to keep secrets. I refuse to sit by idly and let them get away with it. So I've come up with a plan to bring down Team Star and force them to disband for good. I call it Operation Starfall. But I'll need allies to carry out this operation and I'd like you to be one of them. Sure. Let's be buddies. No need to reply. I just said yes. We can discuss the details some other time. Till then, I leave to you. Bye. You know, this feels like Delta Rune, except for the fact that you still kind of get some choice in them. You have more choices. Hello, Boot Bomb. How are you today? I hope you're feeling well. <laughs> Ah, Miss Hartaku. Hmm. Please do try to keep your voice down if you're making calls within the school, won't you? I didn't say anything. Of course, sir. I suspect you're ahead of Steam Talk Star. Probably not, but yeah. You don't want anyone else overhearing any personal information, after all. I do not like what, how you're putting this. Honestly, there are so many things we need to be careful about in this day and age. Off you go, then. Sure, let me... No! No! I don't want to leave the cafeteria. I know he's suspicious. It's just a team star, you say. I know we're supposed to think he's suspicious and stuff, but I just wanted to eat. <laughs> or at least look at what they had. So evil. Um. 
Fine. Uh, what's this? Where do you want to go? I guess I gotta go to the staff room to say hello to Nimona. Although I don't really care for Nimona. But I think Nimona's okay. You know what? Nah. Let's be real. Nimona's annoying. <laughs> I know. I got in trouble for somebody else calling my phone. Telling me they hacked my phone. And all I said is, who are you, basically? Very well, Champion Nimona. I trust you to handle this in my stead. Alright, it's been a pleasure having you, Charisma. <laughs> Sure thing, you can count on me. In fact, I bet this is going to be fun. I'm glad to hear it. Good day, then. Oh, pardon me. I don't trust you. You seem suspicious. Anyway, um, but yeah, no, I'm... Oh, our talk. Hey. You know, I don't think I should say she looks awesome because I feel like she'll take this the wrong way. So I'm just going to go with who was that. I mean, I'm sure that's not really the case, but you know, it's like... Uh, <laughs> you know. Picked your interest, huh? That lady is, well, they call her Lady La Primera. La Primera. She's strong, and she could do pretty much anything. She's got cool practically coming out of her ears. Yeah. Or, she's basically everything I want to be, or that any Pokemon trainer would want to be, really. Really? What if I just want to hang out, have food, and just, you know, catch random things? You know? Oh, which reminds me. Remember in Homeroom when I asked what your dream is? My dream is nothing. If you're still trying to decide what it is you're looking for, I've got an idea for you. You could try to reach champion rank like me. I don't know. I want to just kind of travel. I, as far as I can tell, this seems to be the only way to legally be allowed to have as many Pokemon as I want. Yeah, you can often have soccer clones in the cafeteria. Although, they'll oftentimes tell you not to be in the cafeteria, and, well, I guess it's... Well, when I was in school, the school I went to, you were basically supposed to go out to the outdoor area of the cafeteria. Or, if you were clever, you could go just go over to the, um... There was a courtyard area, and you just went to the courtyard. And that was middle school. Um, I knew a lot of people who would do that. And then in high school... I have no idea, because I never went to the cafeteria. <laughs> Mm-hmm. All I was going to say is, like, in high school, I, I just, like I said, I, I went to the library instead of the cafeteria, so... Yeah. Aw, but talent like yours deserves to be used. Hear me out. I don't think you... I've already befriended Picnic Boy. And Picnic Boy and I are going to be best friends, and we're going to have all the picnics. Whether he knows it or not yet. The trainers who reach champion rank are the ones who raise their Pokemon really strong. But again, I saw exactly what I'm aiming for... I'm just kind of aiming to, um, how do I put this nicely? Uh, be allowed to take my Pokemon where I want. They're pro to your battles. Their moves keep crowds absolutely on edge of the seats. You have to prove yourself to Pokemon League to officially get the cha champion. Mm-hmm. And to do that, you have to do more than just take classes here. You've got to take on eight Pokemon gems. So you, yeah, you know, you, I, I would suspect that I would already know that, you know? That I, I, to get the badges, just because, wouldn't this be common knowledge? But even, like, a toddler knows? And once you've done all that, all that's left is a special test, the champion assessment. I mean, yeah, again, I think everyone knows. And once you pass that, then at long last you'll be a champion. But you can't have more than one champion now, can you? It's every Pokemon trainer's dream, the coolest title anyone could ever hope to get. Is it really, though? Not to brag or anything. I reached Pokemon Trink. I reached champion rank during our last treasure hunt, you know. Oh, the treasure hunt is a special independent study thing we've got here. Should happen soon, but why would I want to... Our last one started not long after the beginning of the school year. But you know what? That means I can go out, I'll be allowed to leave the school, and I'll be allowed to get real clothes, right? Yes? Mm-hmm. It's great. You get to leave the school and go have an adventure and learn however you want. That's exactly what I want. Yes, I want to leave the school immediately. I just wanted the license to be allowed to have Pokemon. I guess you could say my journey to becoming a champion was the treasure I found, maybe? I don't know yet if that's the answer I'm looking for. Yeah, that's what I'm going to go with. I'm going to say, headcanon-wise, you're only allowed to have Pokemon if you enter the academy in this country specifically, this region. And that I joined the school specifically just so I'm allowed to have Pokemon. That's it. <laughs> That's the entire reason. Any 
Anyway, I got a feeling I'll be able to even get even stronger if you and I were both working at it. So you want to steal my group project? My, my project. Hmm. Let me go ahead and save the gem's locations in your map app in case you decide to go for it. Mm-hmm. You know, like, this section, the area is pretty smooth, like, everyone moving and stuff. Maybe it's because I can't see too many people, but, it's like, why was the classroom so bad? The Pokemon gym locations have been added to your map. I'm not sure if I want to go. <laughs> and Victory Road. I haven't even succeeded yet. Give it some thought. Can I leave yet? Ding, dong, dong, ding. No, it should be do 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 do. And you come to the director's office, please, Miss Otaku. Once again, Miss Otaku to the director's office, please. Yeah. Do 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 do. Oh, colorful. Wait, how? Oh, wait, no, that's a kid. Okay. I was about to be like, why is a teacher unable? To... Well, no, never mind. I've known teachers like that. That have done that. Yeah, I don't think I'm getting expelled. Although if I am, it's going to be for the phone thing. And again, that makes no sense. I didn't get... I just wanted to be friends with Mr. Picnic. The Picnic Boy. Thank you for coming, Mr. Taku. Have you been enjoying your time here at the U of Academy? Yes. I, I have done nothing. I want to go to school. But I cannot. That is wonderful to hear. Except at the same time, I don't. What's the worst teacher experience I've ever had? Uh, there was a substitute teacher who I have had, like, they had been, um, so I'd had them, like, every year kind of thing because they were, like, one of the only ones that cycled through. And they always got my name wrong. Always. Like, they would even, rec like, they, they could even this probably, rec and the thing is, it's like, it was very frustrating. Um, other than that, let me think. Um, I guess... You know what? It was an online school experience that I didn't like. Because I had I was taking online classes. And basically what happened was... Um, so, first off, this was math class. This wasn't even like, um, like literature or anything. And I was supposed to do a project. And what I wanted to be once I finished school... And da 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 da, and I decided, you know what, I'm gonna go with violin soloist because that's interesting. And then I couldn't really find any books on it, right? Or any sources. I, I really did go looking around. No, but the thing is, it wasn't math. That was the thing. I think I would've been better off if it was math. The point is, I. So basically, I wrote the essay, and I, like, uh, over a third of it was just I can't find any other references than the two that I have. So, yeah, that's it. And, and then I got chastised. I, I was told I had a great essay, but that because I got a C because I didn't have enough references after my entire essay was literally about, I can't find references for what I want to be. I'm decent at math. I'm not decent at finding references for things. <laughs> it was so annoying. Uh, re the requirements for word towns and stuff isn't that hard. Especially if you're willing to use, like, some really funky words to fit in. Like, it, it works really well. Especially, like, if it's, like... Like, the word count, that's pretty easy. Page count is even easier. So, you know. So, for example, if you need to have more words, just say, like, move quickly. Or, moved it quicker kind of thing, right? If it's a page count, <laughs> I expedited it. <laughs> I moved it quickly. Either way, it really works well. Um, but I, I've always been, I've been pretty decent at essays. When I feel like doing essays. I mean, that's the thing. You've got to actually want to do a proper essay. But, I mean, it's pretty simple. So long as you have your information straight, write your First paragraph, write your paragraphs in the order of two, one, three for interesting points or in, points of interest kind of thing, and then write your ending paragraph. That was pretty much the essays that I, I was fine with. And then there were other essays that were like, um, I mean, the, 
pretty much any essay. And then it's just expand upon that, basically. You know? Like, okay, sure, I... Maybe it requires seven, but... Yeah, exactly, wing it. Uh, but essays are... Anyway, point being, if you treat an essay like a math equation, it works. Kind of is. Anyway. Um, and then it was like, then there was, um, I mean, I liked my science teachers, typically. Like, nine, my favorite science teacher was actually my fifth grade teacher. Science teacher. Best teacher ever. Um... I would argue. <clears throat> um, but let's see. Other than that, like, I, the thing is, like, a good science class doesn't. It, 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 I think I annoyed my <laughs> some of my science teachers because I'd really go all in, like. So we had a project one time that was supposed to be electricity and you had to make a house kind of thing. And I basically, I went to the exact measurements of how much I was allowed to do. And then I made an entire like mansion of a dream house. Or there was a time where there was a volcano thing and literally did hot sauce and stuff. It was always interesting stuff. Kind of thing. And Point being, like... Lots of interesting science projects. I think the science projects are really what, like, sold me on science. Not, like, chemistry. Uh, chemistry is interesting, but I have trouble keep remembering, keeping the formulas in. <sighs> the dyslexia makes it kind of hard to do, like, the, the, um, some of the chemical equations to remember them. Although I was pretty good at guessing them, so that wasn't too bad. Um... Although, I guess the worst project I ever did was a science project. <sighs> well, I've mentioned I'm in Florida, so we've got the... Well, I don't know if it's still that way, but the, um... The FCAT. And that was basically... So that was standardized essays in, um, like, middle and high school. A lot of times. Would match up to that, and it was just... You know, and then I mean, like I said, from there you can expand. Just remember, you have your your pro your um, pro uh, your your first your introduction paragraph and your conclusion paragraph and everything in between. <sighs> you know what? I hate fruit projects myself, for a very different reason. I mean, I actually didn't mind when I had like a group of people. At, again, going back to like the online classes, uh, there was a, there was one project. Where I was supposed to do... It's required, right? They set me up with three different people. In the end, they just were like, um, Okay, you can complete the thing on your own. Because I could never get the other person to respond. And because it was an online class, they could see that the other person wasn't responding to me and that I really was trying. And so, you know, I was just glad. I was like, Yeah, see, you get the dyslexia with Kim. No fun. Anyway, back to the game for a second. Now, you may be wondering why you, we could not simply converse early in the cafeteria. Yeah, I kind of am. Well, the thing is, I did try to do that. Oh, whoops, a friend of mine is rather serious matter would like to discuss with you. Oh. I, like, they, they basically just told me, um... But the teacher told me that I had to have a partner until, like I said, the third person, effectively, that I was paired up with that just dropped out of the class instead of conversing. Like, and it's not like it was on my side. I just was, like, trying to get the, talk to them, like, be like, hey, so... Oh, <laughs> and in the end, the thing that was most annoying about it was that the project itself kind of required you to, um, it was a, required a physical location, which as an online class, you don't know where the other person is or anything. So I, I'm not actually as shocked that the other person just would always, like, opt out 
not opt out even to just like never communicate. And I think they just took a F on that project because the whole thing was so. Eh. Oh no, I'm afraid they aren't actually here in this room. One moment, please. Just allow us to connect. Point being, yeah. I, I just remember that experience very much so, and I was very frustrated. Math <sighs> stands for fantastic, and A stands for off. Sometimes. Hello, Artaku. Nice to meet you. Hello, dad of my new soon-to-be best friend. I am Professor Turo. I carry out Pokemon research within the greater crater of Haldia. At a site known as Area Zero. Okay. I somehow am not shocked. <laughs> yeah. Well, I thought he was supposed to be the Chad meme. Just individual. The professor is, in fact, a graduate of Refine Academy. Or, no, wait, as well as a splendid researcher. I forgot. It's a, it's a dude. Well, allow me to get straight to the point. Artaku, student ID number 805C393. Dude, why do you know that? You are a student who travels with the unusual Pokemon Miraidon. Is that correct? Yes. Um, no. My mom, at least in the game, I have my mom. Who, for some reason, it feels like flirted with the headmaster before I came to the school. Or at the very least... Hmm. <laughs> very friendly with other individuals. <laughs> it's like, why mom? Yeah. As far as I know, no dad. It's just like, nope. Thank you. I appreciate you're honest when confirming the facts. Well, I, I figured you probably knew because I know your son at this point, good sir. He's the one who told me, who dumped Miraidon on me. Because he didn't want Miraidon. Uh, not that I, I, I do not mean to offend you. In fact, of course, I wish for you, ask for your assistance. Yeah. With what? <laughs> You're right on. I get. Oh, how good to see you are well. It has been quite a while since we last met. Yes. <sighs> well, that's an easy question to answer. I like my real world parent that did not walk out on our family. Go get the milk if you will. Um. I know, it's basically a robot, but it's also a Pokemon that's like, how? Muridon was once in my care, you see. Although, let's be fair, like, there's other Pokemon that seem to have been similar. So, in theory, it's possible it's just simply, like, yeah. Yep, exactly. My mom. Uh, that's my favorite part. Its Pokeball was also originally mine. I assume you received it from a young man named Arvin. Yeah, I know. I no longer in any position to be able to manage the Pokemon myself. What, are you dead? This is what I would ask of you. Will you continue looking after Miraidon on my behalf? Yes. I do appreciate our agreement. Dude. Miraidon is greatly weakened and it's currently incapable of battle. Duh. However, it can take on the form of specialized for mobility. In all likelihood, it will require some time to fully regain its capabilities it's once had. I'll provide you with any contact information if you would please get out your phone. Why does everybody just want my phone today? Like, I will be in regular contact going forward to keep tabs on your status. Sure. <laughs> Until then. I mean, let's be fair. It's called Miraidon. As in future? Mirai? Future? Yeah, yes. Could this Pokemon have its origins within Area Zero? Potentially. Turo, don't tell me you actually did it. Don't tell me you actually <laughs> turned yourself into a program. You fool. <sighs> well, it seems that the professor is quite taking quite the favor of you. Of course, the Academy is always here to support you in any way we're able. I'm surprised that's your biggest issue with the game so far, is that the the, 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 the future Pokemon 
as a more robotic. <laughs> I hope you will continue to enjoy our school life, your school life, together with Mir that Miradon. Well, there's only one Miradon, as far as I know, within this reality. Sure, if I had, like, connection to, um, Nintendo Online, maybe I could meet other, but, but that would still technically be, if you think about it, like, alternate reality versions. So, also, I can't leave. Hello, excuse me. Oh, you're still here, Taku. Oof, getting called into the director's office. How'd you land so much trouble on the first day already? Nah, kidding. I know it's not like that. No, you don't. You're me. Mr. Jacques wanted me to show you all the way to your new room in the dorms. It's your very own private room. Let's go check it out. Yeah. You know, why can't I, like, go where I want, you know? I feel like... Also... From today on, this is your room. Actually, it's as new to me as it is to you. Never been here before. You... Maybe check out your new bed? Looks comfy and you must be pretty worn out. Stuff happening on your first day, huh? Quick rest in the bed is all you need for you and your Pokemon to be healthy again. I'll see you tomorrow when you've rested up. Then we'll battle some more. Take care. Um. No, I don't think she's my roommate. I'm pretty sure she has her own place she lives, but... I I would have been very yeah well I do seem to be stuck in school. Can I go in here? Let's leave the bathroom. Make sure. Why can't I go in the bathroom? Like, I mean, for me, I would argue. Like, if I'm being really realistic here and everything, well, the first thing I do before going to bed is I go take a shower. Like seriously. I wouldn't want to get into... Because I have so many allergies, you know? you got to clean off the allergens before you go to bed. Otherwise, the allergens are in your bed and you, you wake up feeling ill and you're not actually ill. you just got sinus problems. Also, I guess technically, you could... I mean, like, I, I'm kind of left with... I should be able to take off the outfit I don't want to be wearing at the moment, you know? I'm pretty sure I'm not being held hostage specifically. Um, no. I want to go look at the kitchen because you know what? At least there's a kitchen. I can't do anything with the kitchen. And yeah, it's daytime. It's like, also, what is this mysterious? Is this supposed to be, but you know, they should show that that's a wall more clearly than just shadow. This looks like floor. Like, it's not raised enough to really look like it could be a wall. I would have probably... If it was me, I'm obviously not the one that developed the game, but what I've done is um, taking it maybe about halfway up the counter here and raised it up to there and had it go across to show just kind of that whole space. Just to kind of show there really is like a wall there of some kind instead of just making it look like it's, it's just not there. And it wouldn't be, like, inhibiting seeing anything else in the room either if it's just that, like, I can't really show what I mean, I guess, but I can't even take out my cat. This is tragic. I guess I'm going to bed. Yeah. I'm not allowed to do anything else. Even though I haven't even taken a single class yet. And, yeah, again, I really am left with, look at that Soul Eater look for the whole thing. It's even got, like, the towers and stuff. Days fly by after you start. The last day arrives for your true adventure to begin. Wait, are you telling me I skipped all my classes? Like, <laughs> what do I have to I sleep through all of my... Ah, my thing fell. Like, <laughs> Hello? Apparently, I got clean this. There we go. I do not know what's up with my model right now. Come on. Reset. Apparently, my eyes are closed forever after after this point. Yeah. 
I don't get it. There we go. That was weird. Okay. <laughs> you know what? How many days? I don't know how many days I've slept. That's the thing I'm asking. Uh, come on. Be set. Well, that's better at least. There we go. How did I get the robot? Oh, simple. No, it was really, really, really simple. Like, I, um... There we go. I went down to the beach. I was just trying to get my way to school. I happened upon the beach. There was this thing on the beach that... And because I was a curious idiot, I fell on the down there. Thankfully, my phone saved me from a very tragic death. And then I gave it a sandwich. And then I decided it was my best friend. Because sandwiches are perfectly good. It was like, yum yum, food. Attention all students, today marks the beginning of an important new assignment. Please assemble in the schoolyard where I will explain in more detail. Can I wear normal clothes? Yet. Also, barging in? Really? It's time! Exactly. Sandwiches are delicious. And that's exactly what I'm saying. It caused friendship between me and the creature. I've been waiting forever for this. Come on, let's go out to the schoolyard. Can I go to the bathroom? Like, I feel like I probably should go. Can I do anything with this? Nope, nope. Like, yeah, I, your own personal kitchen. What am I supposed to do with it? It's starting to get a little annoying. It's just like, where do you want to go? There's only one place I can go. Come on. Stop boxing me in. So frustrating. Excellent. It seems everyone is here. I can eat in the cafe, technically. As usual, the time will be... Treasure hunt. But don't I already have the true treasure? I ask you to set out, travel the world in search of your own treasure. You will have to all learn much within the walls of our foreign academy. I just can't eat in the cafeteria. But if I go out of the, the school, if I manage to, I can eat at the, the cafes and stuff. Now it's time for your eyes to a wider world and deepen your understanding. Explore Paldea's abundant nature. Soak in its rich culture. <laughs> yeah. Discover the Pokemon that live there. And get to know the people too. Wow. Where will you travel? Who will you meet? And what will you achieve? Sure. You'll all you will journey together. Learn new things together. Why will I be traveling with other people? Share with each other's thoughts and no thank you. And find something you might always treasure. Why? <laughs> if that's it, that would be funny. I look forward to welcoming you all back after your independent study. I do, although I don't think we can go to Area 51 and return to us as young trainers. Let the treasure hunt begin. Onward. Considering this is Spain, not America. Or, sorry. It's Paldea, not Unova. So, yeah. No Area 51. And again... I'm sure that that's not what it is. I'm sure it's based off of like a certain school or whatever. I just still... Okay. Nah, only the first three games, I believe. Well, not the first three. Okay, so the Johto, the Kanto, and I think there's one other region in Japan. The Japanese area. Everything else is obviously outside of it. And I only know that because I read the manga. <laughs> like I said, I, I've never really played the games, but I, I do like the manga and stuff, so... Tell ya, it's time for the great outdoors. Come on, Cyclazer, we're riding out. I like Cyclazer. But I think, take care everyone. I remember the great crater of Aldea is extremely dangerous. Mm, I don't think they would be. It's entering is a violation of school rules. Somehow I feel like I'm going to eventually enter that area. What are you waiting for? Let's go! I'm not going with you. 
No. Like, I'm going other places. Like, I'm thinking I could go... Oh, wait. Am I seriously being forced to have to deal with her? Ataku, Ataku! No! The treasure hunt! It's finally starting! Uh, what are we supposed to do? Give me my answer, Nimona, and then go away. Yeah, fair question, since it's your first time. Come on, let's walk and talk. No! Mm, I just wanted to go to one of the restaurants. Nimona. <laughs> or look and see if I can buy clothes. The treasure hunt is a huge part of the Yuva Academy school year. The point isn't to get us all looking for some actual hidden treasure necessarily. I think I should be. We're more just making our own adventures and see what experiences Paldia has got to offer. Mm-hmm. You could try to beat the Pokemon gems. You could help out people in need. You could hunt for real capital T treasures if you wanted to. Even. There's stuff we've never learned sitting in the classroom, you know? This is our chance to learn it. Can I find clothes, please? I don't want to be dressed up as a school girl. Plus, there's so many chances to battle, which is obviously perfect for me. Good for you. You and me are gonna battle for sure. If we run into each other out there. Hope you're ready. Sure. Now it's true. Oh yeah, battling can wait. I meant to tell you. Did you know your phone's map app lets you set yourself destinations? Yes. You could try setting one for one of the gems as your destination. That'd be an easy way. How's that for student council president? Giving your friends insider advantage. We're not friends. I, Arvin! Arvin to the rescue! <laughs> you live in pain, Mr. Failure, really? Insider advantage? Sheesh, you make it sound like we're cheating or something. All I did was suggest she take a look, check out the gyms. It's up to Artaku where she goes. Artaku's gonna have her hands full with <laughs> searching out Titan Pokemon with me. Yes! I didn't have time to waste on something like chasing a Pokemon rank. I think I have to do both. Me and her are going to be too busy visiting the layers of the Titans and nabbing their Herba Mystica. Mystica. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. In serio? Don't go filling her head with weird stories. We're going picnicking. Hey, all I did was invite her along. It's still up to her talk whether she goes, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hmm? I talked to your phone's ringing. Yeah. Mysterious third individual. Hey, Artaku, Cassiopeia here. It's about the Operation Starfall. Remember what I told you before. This team's star is made up of five individual squads, and each one's got their own base. I need you to go to each base, all five of them, and beat the squad boss there. All of you are annoying me. I like picnics, though, so I, I pick Picnic Boy. Team star's grunts may try to get in your way, and I'll be helping you out from a distance. And heads up that the bosses each specialize in a different Pokemon type. Just remember the names of their crews and you'll figure it out. Still no need to worry. With your skills, I'm more than sure they more than up the task. I have not been given any choices here. I'll just get ahead and you added it to my phone. You sneak. I don't care. The star team bases have been added to your map app. Why? I just want to go find clothing and food. Good luck. I'll look you up some nice reports every one week one. Wait a second. Who are you supposed to be? And Team Star, those punks are a serious hazard. They're not Otaku's problem. That's right. Because she's got more important things to do, like searching out awesome ingredients with me. Yes. I thought it was up to Otaku to decide whether she goes or not. Wasn't that what you said, Nimona and Arvin? Ooh. But my... I, I Do I have to... How do you know my... I'm looking forward to seeing what you can pull off, Artaku. Yeah, so many things were out of my map. Bye. Okay, it's been a pleasure having you, Mr. Failure. What's that all about? Artaku, I'm glad you're making plenty of friends, but try not to get dragged into anything dangerous. Uh, I mean, no more weird vibe. You're the one with the weirdest vibes. We've got a big adventure to start. I'm going to battle every single Pokemon trainer I meet. If I just keep trying to get become strongest, I bet the experience that will be the thing I treasure. I don't care. Guess I'll start by heading to a gym and training up some new Pokemon. Here, I'll send you a It's raining now. But what the gym buildings look like? I don't care. Oh, and 
I know we've been running our miles, but it's your call what you do. Go where you want and what it is you really want to do most. A treasure of our very own. For me, that's got to be my... Uh, er, my big dream is tracking down the Herb and Mystica. That's it. Making picnic food. Yes, sandwiches. Once we get to those herbs, I'll make you the absolute best sandwich you've had in your life. See, that's why you're my picnic buddy. Ah, yes! Ah, where'd you come out of? Oh my god, did you just come out because he said sandwich? <laughs> and that's exactly why he didn't want it. Well, you're not getting one. Hmm. Yes, yes! It seems like it wants to start moving. Is it telling you to get on our talk now? Press plus to the the yeah, okay. It is the first time it's rained, yep. And plus plus again to get off. I don't get a choice. It's like see everybody. I wanna go look for clothes. The only thing It's definitively the first time it's rained though. Um, yeah! Oh transform it really looks like some sort of weird cyclizer. As long as you get married on, you can go pretty much anywhere. Paldia is your cloister. Uh, yeah, maybe. Well, if you're going to search for those Titan Pokemon, I guess say set out from the East Gate. But since our chakras actually has some gems, I'd say go to the West Gate. Besides, it's way too easy to get lost in the East. Man, this is why I can't get along with you. I'm out of here. Catch you soon, little buddy. What if I go south? Or I go home? I'll head to a gym. See you around, Artaki. Or, ooh. Let's actually check out clothing stores. Finally begun. So they encourage students, you're free to decide where you want to go and you search for treasure all your own. Okay. Why can't I see? Thank you. Um, you're about to go to your next destination. My map. There are mass outbreaks occurring. Okay. Fact. Um. Yeah, I want to go over here a second. Rough and tough. Let's go to rough and tough. Surely now I can buy some clothes. I'll be right back, Neridon. That, like, I want to wear, right? No, still no. I will find what I want. Yeah, I don't want any of it. See you again soon. Alright, come on, kitty cat. We are leaving. I don't know where I'm going. I don't even know what map or what gate is what. Um. Alright, yep, yeah, that's... I, I didn't mean to... Press every button but the button that's required. Alright, so this is east. So that must be west. Nor south. And there's nothing north. Pokemon League. Um it goes the west. It goes the east. And if I go south, I can go like beyond home. Interesting. There's all sorts of places to go. Uh, yeah. Like, yeah. You can call me that kid all you want. Food? What you selling? Kebab. Yes. So, this is for... Yeah, but it's... Ooh! This would be good. I buy this. Um, I'll pay with cash. Yum yum. Do I eat it now? Or do I get to save it? Oh yeah. Nice. TC power. Encounter power. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's what I was looking for, kinda. So, I think I forgot the south gate. I mean, like, once I leave... I mean, I know this is where I came in, I think. But you know what? I'm okay with that. Because looking at the map, even if I go out the south, I can go wherever I feel like. 
Yeah. And I like that. Actually, come on, my buddy. Yeah. Let's go see if we can't find some stuff. Hmm. I feel like I should probably go hunting Pokemon first. If for no- oh, and trainers. Hi. How about I fight you? Um, the big deliveries, let's make a quick battle. Miss Agoza, you challenged by Iker the Courier. He's cute. Yeah, I mean, the South Gate's the only place I wasn't told to go. Alright. I feel like I just want to bite. Done. The opposing OCD fainted. I know it wasn't grass. I know it's like I should be actually using my other guys. I just wanted to buy food. And so I bought food. I guess you, I deserved... Yeah, I won. Oh yeah. I could fight you, but like... Perfect. Win. You can't win still. Okay. Um I meant to hit the this. Can I give you an item? Position, restore health. Give an item to hold. I think I got one. Um What would I give? Hold one of these berries, it'll be able to free itself from paralysis. Cool. Um. Interesting. I probably should buy an item, but you know. Yeah. Let me heal my Suna. Like, I'm right here anyway. And it says you, it's free? I kind of wish I could, like, send out my other Pokemon without switching the position. By the way, did you know? Mm hmm. I believe it. Yeah, okay. Let's just run over here a second. Ooh, it's raining. Since I have a higher percentage of finding some things, I'm going to see if I can't find some interesting Pokemon. Without, like... Yeah. Super cool. It's just raining, raining, raining. It's, it's definitely very pretty. Ooh, what are you? Oh, I think I already have one of you. Um, yeah, let's just keep moving. Alrighty. I can't go in the water. Um, I mean, these guys are cute. Oh, there's a Magikarp. I could catch a Magikarp. Think, but like I, I can't seem to get in the water. So let's just see what's over here. Nice. Um. Yeah, it's pretty cool looking. Just to wander around. Um. Actually, I just want to ride. Yeah. Huh. I probably should fight some of these guys. I just kind of want to, like, slowly level up my baby. If I can't do that. What can you do? Can you go across? No, I don't think you can. I think you fall. Did I run into something? I ran into a Lechonk. 
Flea Fidget. Yeah, yeah. And then let's just do a quick scratch. There we go. A chunk. Wasn't really useful. Are there, I mean, I like the little chunky chunks. It's kind of nifty that it just like goes. Oh, I got EXP candy. Alrighty. Yes, this is Los Platos. It's definitely a very pretty town. Hmm. <gasps> it jumps. Alright, what's this? I want to buy... I want to see... What do you sell? Num num. Oh, you sell the same things everywhere else. Boring. Area one. Oh, yeah. Like, I just want to wander around some. Like, because I really didn't look around here too What's this? Are these the different kinds of trainers? Like, I had my. I don't want to fight kids, but that seems mean. Um, I think like that is not a kid. I don't know. I don't know. I ran into you. You're annoying. Um, I guess battle. Chomp it down. Size do not. There we go. And it squeaks so proudly. There we go. And now we're up to level 14. Anise wants to learn hypnosis. Let's just see. What have we got? Hypnosis is a suggestion that makes the fall asleep. I don't think so. I mean, I like some of these others, like, but the others actually do some damage. Except for this one, although I'm not sure. Although hypnosis would be better than double team, I guess. What do you want me to do? Alright. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to say do that for now. If it doesn't care that much. I was only suggesting that for me. <laughs> I'm sure in reality it's like... It's like I asked his opinion it's like yeah, I don't care that much. I'm just running to every single one of these guys, aren't I? Uh, let's leaf fidget. There we go! There we go! Alright, I just gotta keep an eye out to make sure I don't go places I don't want to go. But there's the beach. Just a tiny bit of beach, I guess, but... <gasps> Wiglets. Right? Come on. How do I get them to... I guess I gotta... Um... Okay, well, I can get you. You're nifty. Come here. You're my new buddy. I'm gonna have to be careful with you, though. What level are you at? You're, you're level four. I might just be able to catch you. It might be a little bit much, but... Nope. Yeah, it's fine. You're not terribly strong, are you? Um... Bite it. Oh wait, I shouldn't have, but... No! Dang. I, I wanted it so bad. What are you? You're, you're a, um... A wingle. I guess just scratch it. We don't want it to be too powerful. I'm too strong! Alright, um...
Let's see, how do I do this? Nope. There goes Kitty, but come on, surely. Can I aim? How do I get this guy? No! I, I clearly, I have him too close, it just, it senses in. Well, I got that guy. It's attention. Let's try this again. Uh, let's do a different Pokemon. Um, let's chunk. This one is too powerful. Go on, chunkers. Yeah, you might be better. Um, can this, yeah, this can do a little bit of power. Okay, that's perfect. All right, let's try this again. Doot, doot. Oh no! Magikarp! Well, I caught the boizel. All right, so what are we calling this? Or do I have to name it? Come on, Kevin. All right, or I guess I could just, since I seem to be more. What do you want to call it? This Boisel female name. <laughs> or do I name it since I seem to be alone? Anyway, um, let's see, I guess I could call it, let's, do, 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 do. I guess let's just call it Otter. I'm alone. Otterly. It's an Otter. Uh, it's not really an Otter. Though. It's more like... Eh, I messed up. You know what? Just send it to the boxes. I forgot to name it. I Still, I like you. I, I just don't know what to call you. Alright, um, come on, let's try this again. Actually, let's just get, get you, yeah, you. Magikarp! Surely I can just catch it. Come on. Catch the, the Magikarp. Surely, right? Yeah. I knew it, Magikarp. Was obvious. So we call him the magic carp. I guess maybe I'm the one naming. All right, I do have an idea though. So I'm gonna call it. Uh, oops. Let's say. Um, and then I think it is, I could be remembering wrong. It could be the other way, my dyslexia, but, um, I am so tired. I am probably spelling this wrong, but you know what? I'll fix it later. I will fix it in post. I'm realizing I probably spelled it slightly wrong, I think, because I'm so tired. And I don't want to go look it up. So it's just like, yeah, I just want the Wiglet. Come on, Wiglet. Like, seriously, no. 
Why would you hide from me? I wasn't even that far away. Are you in the water? Sort of. Gotcha! Ha! I want you. Wiglet. I don't think I have to battle. It's a level 3. It should be fine. Done. Caught the Wiglet. Alright, it's highly different species. There's simplets. Lovely. So, got a name for Wiglet? I guess not. For now, I'm just doing this because it's just like. Yeah. Nope, I just wanted one. Another thing I don't have now from over here. What are you? How powerful are you? Um. I mean. <laughs> Let's just try. I only have one left. I may fail. I might have to go buy more Pokeballs. Come on. Yes! Can I get a name for this, the, the Wingle? Please? Please? Mm -hmm. Or do I have to come up with one for this one too? Give you uh, like 20 seconds. And if the answer is no, I, I do. I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> Jetpack? Jetpack it is. Are you sure not? I guess. There we go. Alrighty, jetpack. Into the box you go, jetpack. I mean, they all get names. Obviously. Even if they go to the box, except for one. Alright, I... It's already getting... It's like... There we go. It's night time, I think. Ish. Wait. I didn't mean to run into- well. I mean, this is... Just destroy it soon enough. Oh! It survived, Bubble Beam. Ow. That's not terribly effective now, is it? And then, I mean, just this. Yeah, that was a real- I'm sorry, but- <laughs> At this point, I just kind of am already kind of just there, power-wise. I guess that's all the things I'm supposed to go check out. And yet, I'm not. <laughs> I have no interest. Oh, you can't go up that way? Even though that clearly is a way you should be able to go up? Come on. You not grab the item. Thank you. Alrighty. Alright. Uh, what's that? 
swift. Well, that's cool. I should go find a pokey. Because I don't have any, um... I mean, I have a netball, but uh, it's not really going to do what I need now, is it? Huh. I found more moves. Um... Oh, I fell. Whatever. I guess I should go back. See if I can't get some balls and stuff. Ah, you guys. And if you're a level seven, well, okay. Yeah, just leave the jit. Alright, yeah, yeah. And then. I mean, they, they just, they, they're just not giving me much. I mean, it's slowly, I guess. Uh, sort of. I do need more Pokeballs, though. For if I eventually decide I want to, um... Plus, I should probably heal... I mean, my guys don't really need healing, but, you know, I should probably heal them anyway. Alright, um... I'm amazed I'm allowed to just run around at night. Like... If that was one thing I would not think. Hit you. You first. Heal. I'd like to heal. There we go. Heal all my Pokemon, please. Thank you. Even though, like, none of them need it. Alright, cool. Uh, mass outbreaks. You may be able to find those out in the area. Ah, I see. Okay. Got it. You. What kind of Pokemon can I help you? I'd like to buy. I. Well. I suppose I would like myself. Um. Yeah, we'll go. Eleven, actually, not too bad. Well, I like the Pokedoll. Pay with cash. I should probably start hitting up the, the, the guys. Have a premiere bowl on the house. Thanks. I'm good. I should probably start selling stuff too. Soon too. But you know. Let me go up here. That is, I haven't been up here really. Um. Oh, that. <gasps> Those things were so cute. Um. Oh, what, what level are you? Um, scratch. There, perfect. It's super effective, that's good. Alright, got the combi. Take that. There we go. Come on. Alright, so what are we naming the bee? B's gotta get a name. Hmm. Uh. <sighs> Fair enough. I mean, that's how it goes, isn't it? Um, but if you don't have a name, I'm gonna call it Jam. Because it's funny. To call the combi that's clearly made of like the honey larva kind of thing jam which is totally not honey um but what do you want to call it bumblebee sure that works bumblebee it is um, um of the bee. There we go. To the box bee. I'll catch one of each. And I should probably start bubbling them up just to kind of 
Well, I do kind of want to, like, evolve my guys. You know? I think it'd be cool to sort of, like... What was that? Oh, Fletchlings. That feels like that's something. What is that? Are you a Pokemon? I... I can't... What the heck? I can't move. Oh, okay. Oh, I got a Gibby Ghoul coin. That's interesting. I don't know what it is, but you know... Interesting. Um, I should probably go find the sandwich guy, right? There's more of those guys. I don't have you. I need you! Flamigo. Um, okay. I need to be very careful about this. This is 40. This is 60. This is 40. This is 60. Let's do a normal attack. Alright. Double kick. That's fine. Yeah, I got that. Let's scratch again. There we go. It's fine. And then I'm going to catch you. And then I guess I'll heal my Pokemon. I'll heal soon. I don't want to go back, so. And the Boona Boona. Alright, we gotta name. Which one? The Flamigo? I like the Flamigo. I need this. To have. I think I know. Alright, give me a name, but if you don't have one, I do. I'm just waiting and seeing. What you get? Because for me, I'm going to name it after one of my chickens. One of the best chickens we ever got. From the what? Yeah, this Pokemon is going to be Rosie. But Rosie must be protected. Go to your box, Rosie. I'm sorry. Also, why can't they put them in? But I hate her to Rosie. I always do. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, I, I like, like I said, I like it because it's, it's my, um, Oh, you can't swim. You managed to scramble there. Really? Why? Yeah. I could swim there. You know? Ooh, what is that shiny thing? I want to know. What is this? Out on Paldea, you'll find spots with gleaming crystals emitting brilliant gleams. If you investigate one, you'll be able to take Terror Raid Battle and try to defeat a powerful terror Pokemon. Okay. I guess challenge alone. I don't know if I'm going to win or not. This is for fun. I honestly don't think I have much hope. Not winning. Because I forgot to heal my my baby. <sighs> okay. Okay. Alright. From a mile, but you also tend to play in fantasy, so avoid letting your pink come in if you can. Um, cheering. 
Okay. Uh, how do I cheat? Um, you know what? That's the one that's more powerful, right? Yeah, magical leaf it. Yeah. Ah, oh, dear. Alright, I apparently can cheer my Pokemon on. I think I'm still okay. I, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to battle. Uh. Oh, okay. Cool. Battle. I'm going to do this. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. Alright. I'm still okay. One more magical leaf. I think we won. Right? Ow. Okay. But I won. So, catch. I wanted a Pichu, so this is perfect for me. If I can catch this, it'd be brilliant, because I want a Pichu. Woo! I got the Pichu. Right? Right? Yeah. All right. I got lots of things. Nifty, nifty. All right. I would love to hear what you want me to call the Pichu. I just wanted a Pichu. Because otherwise I'm calling it Sparky. What you think? <sighs> Got any names for this Pichu? I'm guessing not, so I guess it's Sparky. <laughs> Alright. Sparky it is. Although I would also think of maybe like, um, oh, what was it called? Oh, I wonder if I could... I don't think I could fit it. So, yeah, I think it's Sparky. Unless he, yeah. Sparky it is. Sparky the Pichu. That's what you get, Sparky. Oh, I kind of, I just, I already have one. Lord Floof. I just wanted one of you. And I was so upset earlier when I couldn't find one of you. <laughs> also, all the Pokemon here are pretty mid. Oh, oh. <sighs> I mean, this is good enough. Is 
Yeah, yeah. Alright. Yeah, I could have bitten it and it would have been dead, but you know. There you go. I'm just trying to slowly get to level 15 and then 16. I don't really know what these are or if they're any good. And again, I'm still left with, why does this game not run anywhere near as good as the Square Enix game? That's kind of what I find sad. I mean, what's this? One. This one looks cool. Wait, isn't it one of those guys? Okay. Yeah, you! I need one of you, drowsies. Uh, you're level four. I wonder if I can just catch you. Please? Those ones where it starts getting iffy, but... Yeah. The drowsy was caught. Alright, let's see what... The question is, is the drowsy female or male? If it's female, it's gonna be called chamomile. If it's not... I need a name. I need a name! Hmm. I guess I could call it... Nah. I think if I'm gonna do it, I'm just gonna do it like this. For a very refreshing smell. Mint! Enjoy being in the box, Mint. Alright, um, I saw one of those things. Alright, um, yeah, this. The Gimme Gold Coin. What the heck are they? It's interesting. Oh, what? I didn't want to fight you. Hmm. Magical leaf it. There we go. I just want to paint. Alright, so what are you? Um, I don't really want a jiggly buff right now. Oh, I'm running to you. Yeah, yeah. I'm drowsy. It's revealed to be one that's in the nose. So no. Um, just bite it. Super effective. There we go. Don't you feel so brilliant? I have a trainer. I can fight the trainer. I don't have one of you. No? Like, I literally am standing inside of you, practically. Can I attack you? Um, I don't want to use too much, so I guess just leafage it. Perfect. Not very effective. Well, it doesn't matter if it used hypnosis or not. I'm going to be able to catch it at this point, or I'm going to kill it. <laughs> gotcha. Ghastly. Alright. Hmm. I don't know what to call it. What to call this? You know what? You are just purple. <sighs> purple. Purple to the box. There we 
we go. I mean, honestly, in a lot of ways, it's like hard coming up with names that are unique for every single one. Another one of those gimme gold coins. I don't really know much about it. Confused, right? I feel like that's how I feel. That door was so weird. I can't stop wondering what's behind the weird door or lid or cover, whatever it is. Maybe a battle will take my mind off it. You want to battle me? By Axel. Axel! Do you have a friend named Roxas? Or perhaps Sheila? Attack fell. Hmm. Well, it doesn't tell me that any of this is. Terribly effective, so I guess just use bite. I use peck. It's super effective. Now I'll use magical leaf. Not very effective. Okay. Learn magical leaf. Well, good for it. Um, I'm gonna bite it. Have fun with that. I win. <gasps> level up, level up. A baby learn. My baby wants to learn quick attack. Um, let me look at it. I don't think I want to do quick attack though. Although I just, what's quick attack? Power is forty. Accuracy is a hundred. This move always goes first. Um, then let's trade Scratch out for it. Because otherwise it's basically the same. Yeah. And I defeated that dude. Just what could be behind the- whoa, wait, I lost? Dude. What door? There's there's no door. You have me curious now. Where is this door? Is this the door? It feels like it should be a door. Like, seriously. I see the gas blaze. And the drowsies, because it's late. Like, I would think this would make sense. Like, it feels like it's supposed to be a hint to something, but I don't feel like it's anything I can find. Um. Which is a little disappointing, because it's like, well, what do you. Oh, is that the door? Okay, nifty. Found the door. Oh, I can use the crit rate. Oh, uh, wait, no, I wanted to look at it. Uh, bag. So, it's under battle items. I have an item that the effect disappears if the Pokemon leaves the battle. Um,. Hmm. Give to my boo. I guess. Interesting. And then. What is this? Faint writing is carved into the shrine. Herein lie sealed the ruinous tablets. Ooh. I can't do anything with it. It's so sad. Really? Can you do anything, maybe? Um. Like, maybe there's something on my map here? No. 
What's this? Like, I can go for an outbreak guy, but I don't really feel like it. There's this thing. Got a rare candy. Psybeam. Uh, are these? No, they're just those things. Alright, so... Pretty satisfied now. Although, I'm starting to think that I just gotta... Except a different cape is the way to go. Alrighty. Yeah, you thought you'd get me, but you, you couldn't. I'm too clever for y'all. Interesting. Not good. Like, it's fun collecting items, and I mean, that's really all I gotta do. Oh, hello. Another gimme gold coin. I thought this would totally lead somewhere, but it didn't. Um. <sighs> very strange. Very, very, very strange. This whole thing, you know? Um. Oh, do I have. No, you're. You're a dude I could fight. <laughs> Do you think you could topple me, the mightiest martial artist here? Yeah, I kind of think I should need to move up here. You are challenged the Al by Alejandro. Ah, bleh. You are challenged by Alejandro, the Black Belt. Hmm. Alejandro, the Black Belt, took my rough. Go sooner. I think I need to heal you up, but I just bite you. I can. Use tackle. I'm okay still. Bite. Woo! There we go. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna do another one? Oh, the chunk. Uh, keep current. Suna's pretty good at this. Alright, what's the level? Level 12 a chunk. I should probably heal my baby soon, right? Yeah, I should probably, but. This is the one that's. Yeah. What the? Yeah, it's like. Alrighty. Tail whip. Oh, yeah, tail whip's fine because that's defense. Um. Like, dude. It'll only work if I don't take you out. The chunk fainted. Dude doesn't have a third one, right? Cool. Bubbles wants to learn the move Slam. Let's see what they've got. Um, Slam. Um, duh. Sorry. Like, Bubbles, why do you know Splash? No matter what Slam does, it's better than Splash. I guess switch Pokemon. Um, Let's have Anise go out, because I haven't really used Anise yet too much. I mean, I have a little bit, but... Yeah. Makoshida... With thick fat. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna. This, this one is 65, and this one is 50. Disarming boys. Healy Ray, confuse the target. Okay. I wanna do this one. Break out. Now. No! You. Yeah, there we go. Super effective. Wow. Alright, my accuracy fell. 
Guess I do him again then. Shit. Alrighty. Anything else good, sir? Another one? Oh, I defeated. Cool. Very well, henceforth I'm the second mightiest. Well, I got a lot of money, so I'm quite satisfied. That bubbles is evolving. Wait. Seriously? I had done nothing with bubbles. Congratulations, bubbles is for Meryl. Good for you, Meryl. Absolutely nothing was done with bubbles. But you know what? That's fine. I'm wealthier now. That's what really matters. Right? Alright, I need to go heal my guys up. Um, I just literally played through the night, didn't I? Anyway, I think I'm gonna go heal up my Pokemon and I might be done for today for that. Just cause, you know. I, I just don't really have much else I can do. Ooh, what's that? Oh, I got some Pokeballs. Um, but yeah. Alrighty. I think I'm doing pretty good, all things considered, since I'm not fighting, like, the big bosses. Actually, I think I'm gonna do one other thing while I... Really quickly. I mean, obviously, when my guys get healed up. One more thing, I think. Yep, they're all healed up. Yay! Okay. Who's that trainer? Instead of who's that Pokemon? Anyway. See, you've got people discussing how they wish they had Pokemon and da 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 this, da 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 that. And I'm just kind of left with, like, Wow. Oh, well, no, I wouldn't want you. Although, all that will be required is... Just chomp them. Somebody will level up. Alright, I just wanted this. Come on. Or not. I guess. Fight again. Go, oh, come. Alright, now. This is annoying because I just. Fight again. Alright, got that. Alright. Just chomp. There we go. <laughs> even, even so, just like <laughs> speaking expletives, I think. Like, <gasps> oh, you're cute. What are you? I have to be careful with you. How cheese you? I guess. Let's just do a quick attack. Nothing too big, right? There we go. Yeah. I Pokeball you. There we go. Yes. All right. Super close to well. I guess Ralph's leveled up. Yes, I'm gonna give it a nickname. Let's 
could be Picard. Yum, yum, yum. There. And go to a box. Yeah. Alright, and then... Alright, um... Like, really? I guess there's a trainer dude over here. Gotta get stronger. Okay. Gotta revive. What's this? Interesting. It doesn't seem to be much of anything. Like, why would I come over here? I, I don't understand. go. Bizarre. I got a luxury ball. Okay. Nifty. Can I jump over this rock? Yeah, I can. Cool. Um. Yeah. Apparently, I can't jump over this thing, though. Okay. Well, I could go down there, though. Ooh. I know what I want to do. Hmm. Look at that. Well, but I don't have a water Pokemon type. This could get frustrating quickly, isn't it? Or maybe it shouldn't, but it feels like it. Yeah. All right. What are you up to? Yeah. Hello there. I'm the Pokemon League. I don't care about you. Defeat four traders in the area one. There's a lovely prize with your name on it. You've defeated four traders here in Area 1 in the South Bronx. Here's your lovely prize. I didn't want it. Other areas around... Okay. Fancy? Anyway, I guess I gotta go in. I guess I gotta pick a different... But, I think that's gonna be it for tonight. I might stream tomorrow. I might not. I probably won't. So, yeah. Um, it's been lovely having you. Hope to see you again probably Thursday, but maybe potentially uh, another time. Or Tuesday, but probably Thursday. Yeah, because it's usually Thursday. It's been a pleasure having you. Hope to see you on Thursday. If not soon. Um, yeah, bye-bye!